morning, everybody. Um, this is uh, my cycle eight, 10 DPO. Um, and I'm gonna be continuing doing tests. I saw like, a super faint line um, yesterday. So I wanted to find a stronger one today. Um, hopefully it's a stronger line, not an even lighter line. Cause that could be, a, if, if it is a pregnancy, it could be a chemical pregnancy or evap lines. So, um, I'm going to do three tests. I'm going to do the easy at home test, the dollar tree test. And, um, I got the equate, um, test. It's kind of like similar to the uh, first responses compared to first response. This one only has a line in a line. There's no plus. There's no double line in the same bracket. There's um, the circle with a line and an oval with a line if it's positive. The circle won't have a line at all if it's negative. So it's supposed to be five days sooner. Um, I should be starting my cycle within that time. I'm trying to think in like four days. So if I do start, it's like four days away. So I'm going to set you guys to the side. I'm only doing tests, so it should, should be the semi short video because I have to get ready for work. <laughs> Sorry, I'm even more haggard looking because my daughter decided to wake up at 2.30 in the morning. Wide awake. 2.30 in the morning, wide awake. She got up, walked in the living room, wanted to watch Frozen. Screamed when I tried to put her back to sleep. So I'm like, yeah, fine. I'm gonna lay on the couch while you watch Frozen and hopefully you'll fall back asleep. Well, she did after she watched the entire movie of Frozen. So she would not fall back asleep. Like she fought me, would not go back to sleep till about 4.45, almost 5 a.m. Then I had to wake up at 6 a.m. for work. So needless to say, I'm running on like three hours of sleep because she also had woken up at like 10, eight, like or 10 uh, last night with a nightmare. So I'm wondering if that's why she didn't want to go back to sleep. So I don't know, but today's going to be a long day, a long Monday. All right, let's get back to these tests. Um, easy at home. My test. One, two, three, four, five. Place that back right here. Yeah, so my daughter is enjoying her beauty rest right now. So the blank test from her Dollar Tree. Dropper for three drops. One, two, three. And just that equate um like knockoff of the first response. I got it because it was three dollars cheaper than the first response, and I figured I'm just wanting to line check, so I'm not gonna spend all that money when I have another clear blue and a digital, so this is just oh I should have read the directions on this. Let me see. Um, five seconds, light test flat on surface, the result in two minutes. Okay. This is a little stream, but hopefully this acts almost the same. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
two, three, four, five. Oh, if I can put it on the cap the right way. So, I'll let these kind of do their thing. For a couple minutes, yeah. So, she's enjoying her beauty rest, and it's probably going to be a long day at daycare for her. My aunt who runs it, so I don't I don't know if she'll take naps or not today. Hopefully she will, but yeah, last night was rough. Rough. Yeah, I ended up having to take her out in the living room finally. Well, she walked out there, but I had to just give give in because my husband wakes up early for work and I just didn't want to keep fighting her and having her scream at us. And then him lose out on sleep as well. Because it's just, there's no need for both of us to lose out on sleep. So, mama's usually the one. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> but you know what? I get to sleep on my birthday and on Mother's Day. So that's two, two times out of the year. Or when I'm sick. So. <laughs> oh my gosh. So I am very tired. I'm sorry. So. Yeah, so this is, anyways, this is cycle eight. And this is, um, uh, a lot, or sorry, 10 DPO. And I swear I had gotten a faint line on 9 DPO. And I'm looking, it's looking like there's getting to be some faint lines again. So, um, so I, and I love that. But I'm just like so scared. Like my aunt Flo is supposed to be here in like four days. That's four days. I can still be pregnant. At least four days I'm pregnant. When Aunt Flo decides to come, that's the real test. That's one of the real tests of if this baby is going to going to remain, stay in there. So Every time I've had a miscarriage, most of my period, except for um, the last miscarriage we had lasted about another few days into it. So it's just hard. I just, I'm, I'm, it's getting more and more exhausting and I haven't even had as many losses as a lot, as a lot of women. It's just getting emotionally exhausting. It's getting exhausting in your body because you have to restart your body. You have to let it heal, wait longer, and just, yeah, it's hard. So I think things will be as dark as they get. Um, so maybe it could maybe get darker, but here's. Here is the one to focus. Oh, can I drop it? Oh, no. Of course I drop it. And I mess it up. So here's this test. I'm trying to focus on it. Sorry if it doesn't want to. Come on, guy. There's a really faint line, um, but again, it's not legit until I get that strong line. I guess you can almost see it. It's right, um, well, no, I lost it, but it's like right there. Yeah, so you guys, you can kind of see it, but move back to 40, you can almost see the line with it. Moving. Okay, so that's not easy at home. I'm so disappointed in these Dollar Tree ones that you don't even have to catch it. Like, there is that a faint line there as well. But that one's harder to see. I don't know if you guys can see it or not. Oh my gosh. Now this one. You can see. 
again i mean guys that's legit you can see it i know you can you only need one line in that circle so i am pregnant i am i'm gonna do a digital one tomorrow just so i can have it just spelled out and it'd be even more real just praying, just gosh, continuous praying. And I hope you guys, you know, can pray or pray for me and send some sticky dust my way or anything, you know, and just let me know if you guys are within the same amount of time. And we've got a positive, I'll pray for you um, and send good thoughts your way. The real test is going to be that cycle day 25 when that ugly ant flow is supposed to show up. So, so I am pregnant and it's amazing. And I just, I want to enjoy this, even if it's for four days. I don't want to worry too much. Like I did with my daughter's pregnancy, I just worried every day until she was in my arms. And uh, so this time I want to kind of do the opposite of just enjoy that. Even if it's for the four days that I have left, you know, this is a child to me. We've had a total of now six pregnancies, six children, you know, four in heaven, one on earth, and hopefully our second one on earth as well. And it will be our last child, so it's, you know, going to be a bittersweet pregnancy because it'd be, if it is, you know, successful because it will be my last pregnancy, which is also I want to enjoy it. And I want to catch it early and enjoy every single day being pregnant. And no matter how difficult it may get, again, I'm not having any symptoms other than burping like randomly and it's like I'm more like gassy so I'm more burps and other forms of gas and uh, like my breasts don't feel sore well never like now my nipples are kind of sore but like they don't feel sore but they feel like just full and heavy like and so I don't know if that's because that maca or not um but they're you know, other than that, I haven't really had any symptoms. I've had light cramping, um, dry mouth, very thirsty. So, um, yeah, so that's about it. Like, I haven't had, like, any other. And mood swings. If it's not because of the maca, it's because of a pregnancy then. Because I've been on, a, like, an emotional roller coaster, whether it's crying or or getting angry, or laughing uncontrollably at stupid stuff, like, I don't know, just, like, complete mood swings, so, and that would be new, because with my daughter, I didn't, I would, I didn't have those mood swings at all, I was great throughout the pregnancy, my husband was really happy I didn't have, like, those angry moments or anything, so, no cravings or anything, so this is still, this is still only 10 DPO, so, and legit got a line. Got that nice little early line. So there is that legit line. That one isn't faded. Like not too bad at all. So you guys, I'm gonna get ready and try to get my kid in the car sleeping still so she can sleep a little longer. So you guys have a great day. I may not post this until a little later just because. It's legit positive. And, you know, I want to tell my husband first and her family, friends. And unfortunately, that means I have to wait for blood tests and heartbeat. And it's going to be a little long, way longer than when you guys will see this. So, but keep following because there will be more and more videos. I'm going to test a little more. I'm going to get that digital. And then I'll also update you once my airflow comes. 
if it comes. So, okay, guys. Have a good day.